Hello friends, this is class 6th, a pack with the sun book, lesson 2, the friendly mongoose. And this is our lecture 2 that we are going to do. So, let's begin with that. First of all, I'll tell you the points to be covered in today's class. First of all, summary of the story which I explained in previous class will be done. Then new words and question answers will be done. Then at last homework will be assigned on the basis of today's work which will be done in the class in the lecture. Summary A farmer, his wife and their child lived in a village. Once there was a farmer and his wife. They used to live happily in a village with their son. They loved him very much. Means they loved their child very much. There was also a baby mongoose in the house who they believed would be their son's companion and friend in future. Means once the farmer thought that they should have a pet so that their son could play with that pet when he would grow up. This was being said by farmer to his wife one day. The farmer's wife agreed upon that and the farmer brought a baby mongoose. The baby mongoose was just newborn. After some time, the baby mongoose grew up and when it was 5 to 6 months old, it took its largest size means it was fully grown in 5 to 6 months. But the farmer's son was still a baby who could just sit in 5 to 6 months. One day, the farmer and his wife went out leaving the child alone with the mongoose. Means, one day the farmer's wife wanted to go to the market. She fed the baby and then the baby was sleeping in the cradle. She picked up her basket and she said to her husband to keep an eye on the child because there was mongoose with the child. She was afraid if the mongoose would harm him or not. Then the farmer said that mongoose was the best friend of the child so he wouldn't harm him. Still the farmer was sitting there near child keeping an eye at him. Then after some time when the farmer was getting bored he thought to go out to his fields. His fields were nearby, his fields were not at a distant place, so he decided to go there. While coming back from the fields, he met, <coughs> he met some of his friends and he, uh, he was busy in talking that he didn't know about the timing that he was getting late. Meanwhile, what happened till then the farmer didn't reach the home. Meanwhile, what happened? The farmer's wife returned home from the market carrying a heavy basket. The farmer didn't even come to his home. Meanwhile, the farmer's wife came back to, her, uh, to the home from the market carrying a heavy basket. She had a heavy basket in her hands and that basket was full of groceries. Groceries means food items. Now you can imagine how heavy it would be. How heavy the basket would be because she was the basket was full of groceries when she came back. She found the mongoose at the entrance of the house with blood on his face and paws. As a tradition, when somebody comes at our home, we go out at the door to welcome that guest. The same was being done by 
the mongoose as soon as the farmer's wife came the mongoose went to the door to welcome her for as a tradition we welcome somebody who comes at our home so the mongoose also went to the door to welcome her and what did she find what did the farmer's wife saw see she saw that at the entrance when the mongoose was there his face and paws were smeared with blood there was blood all around the face and paws of the mongoose now she get shocked she got shocked she jumped to the conclusion that it was her son's blood and the mongoose was the guilty one as soon as the farmer's wife saw the mongoose face and paws smeared with blood the farmer's wife didn't even think once and she concluded without even thinking that the blood which was there on the paws and face of or uh, and the face of the mongoose that blood would be her son's blood and she thought all of a sudden at that time only she thought that mongoose had killed her son because she was full of anger she could not think anything she was blindly imagining that the that the mongoose might have killed her son she killed the mongoose and later she realized that she was at wrong as soon as the farmer's wife saw the mongoose face and paws smeared with blood she could not even think once she concluded that the mongoose might have killed her son and that blood which was there on the paws and the face of the mongoose would be her son's blood she didn't even think once and she gathered all her strength and put that basket full of groceries on to the mongoose now you can imagine you can think that how heavy that basket would be and later she realized that she was at wrong now when did she realize that she was at she was at wrong when she went into the room where her baby was sleeping she saw that a snake a black snake was lying on the floor and there were many pieces of the snake it was being torn by the mongoose only that's why there was blood on the face and the paws of the mongoose because that snake was being killed by the mongoose and there was blood all around that snake which was being killed then what happened she went out and cried to show her repentance as soon as she came to know that the snake was being killed by the mongoose and whatever she did what was wrong because she was full of anger she was blind in anger actually so she went out touched the mongoose and she cried at that time mongoose was not there to see that the mo- that the farmer's wife was showing her repentance he was not there to see her sobbing at that time so here we learn a lesson that we should not act before knowing the whole story first of all think twice thrice and then we should act thank you now will do the new words discussion of previous homework now we'll discuss the homework which i assigned you in previous class unlock along with the new words and rest of the questions of the same lesson so that we would complete the same lesson today only so for this you have to take out your notebook in which you are doing your work or register in wherever you are doing your work you need to make a format 
first of all you will write the name of book a pact with the sun then lesson 2 then the friendly mongoose then you will writing new words number 1 companion companion means friend while on the other hand company of someone is known as friendship number 2 bushy thick and hairy bushy is generally used for tails bushy tail fed fed is second form of feed if we say my mother feeds me if each and every time for example uh, she feeds me three of the meals of the day means morning meal afternoon and then uh, evening meal then we say that she gives food me three times she gives me food three times in the same way fed is the second form of feed in the same way gave is second form of give so fed is give food frankly in an honest and direct way when we say to be very frank i want to say this thing means you are very honest and directly you are saying something that is in an honest and direct way number 5 screamed screamed is very loud and high sound number 6 afraid filled with fear when you are frightened of something you are afraid when you are filled with fear you are afraid so that is called afraid number 7 customary customary is tradition for example it's a customary to welcome someone who comes at our home to do the hospitality when somebody comes at our home so that is our customary number 8 wicked wicked means morally bad number 9 hysterically hysterically means situation in which someone reacts in an uncontrolled way like farmer's wife did as she was blind with anger so she didn't know how was she how was she behaving she reacted in an uncontrolled way means hysterically she reacted number 10 rage means anger number 11 groceries means food items number 12 sobbing sobbing means to cry while taking in short sudden breaths number 13 hastily means quickly hurriedly when you are in hurry that is known as hastily number 14 smeared that is overspread means when something is overspread and its spot uh, spots are there near about that place so that place is smeared with that something for example mongoose face was smeared with blood means the the blood was overspread onto his face now let's begin with question answers you can either write let's answer the questions or question answers as heading question number 1 Why did the farmer bring a baby mongoose into the house? Answer: The farmer brought a baby mongoose into the house because he wanted a friend or companion for his son. I repeat: The farmer brought a baby mongoose into the house because he wanted a friend or companion for his son question number 2 why didn't the farmer's wife want to leave the baby alone with the mongoose answer the farmer's wife 
didn't want to leave the baby alone with the mongoose because she was afraid that the mongoose would harm her son i repeat the farmer's wife didn't want to leave the baby alone with the mongoose because she was afraid that the mongoose would harm her son question number 3 what was the farmer's comment on his wife's fears as actually the farmer's wife was afraid that the mongoose would harm her son in her absence so she was afraid that's why she asked her husband to keep an eye on her son then what was the farmer's comment what was the farmer's answer let's see the farmer's comment on his wife's fears was that she needed not to be afraid as the farmer's wife was afraid in uh, uh, it was being answered by the farmer that she needed not to be afraid he said that the mongoose was a friendly animal it was as sweet as their baby and they were the best friends question number 4 why did the farmer's wife strike the mongoose with her basket answer when the farmer's wife came back from shopping she saw that the mongoose face and paws were smeared with blood blind with rage she struck the mongoose with a heavy basket full of groceries so this was the reason that the farmer's wife struck the mongoose with her basket because she was she was thinking that the mongoose had killed her son though she didn't even meet her son at the entrance only she concluded that uh, her son was being killed by mongoose did she repent her hasty action how did she show her repentance now here the meaning of repent is to feel or say sorry this is the meaning of repent and repentance means how did she say sorry or how did she feel that let's see that yes she re- repented her hasty action hasty means the action which was being done quickly without even thinking she repented she felt sorry for her hasty action she touched the mongoose now the question is second one is how did she show her repentance she touched the mongoose and cried she saw the painful result of her hasty action she could clearly think she could clearly see that what was the result of the action which was being taken by her hastily that was the act of repentance being done by her homework learn new words and question answers of lesson 2 the friendly mongoose of a pact with the sun